Hey everybody, it's Wednesday, April 15th. It would have been tax day, but we all got a break on that. So let's get started on ELA 7 virtual edition for today. All right, today's tasks, pretty straightforward. One, we've got vocab list 22, the story. Then we have a, an online worksheet over um, the article you were supposed to read yesterday, the day we sent a message to aliens. And then finally, because that should take you a real long time, I would encourage you to get going on your reading plus for this week. And as always, grab a book, read something. All right, so let's break it down. Vocab list 22, your story is due by midnight tonight. So um, we should all know how this works, but I'm gonna go over a couple of things because apparently some people have forgotten them. Forgotten them. So um, pay attention to spelling and needed endings on your vocabulary words as you're filling in the blank um, on the top part. And then also pay attention to those things in your stories too. I'm getting some uses of the words that aren't making sense and things like that. So make sure that you're paying attention to any needed endings or make sure that you're spelling them correctly. Um, also, I've got some people who are not necessarily, um, you know, reading the story very carefully. And there are a couple of things, there are a couple of ways that I can tell that. One, I can tell you're not reading this story very carefully because you're not using the context clues that are in the story to help you determine which word goes there. So I had quite a few people mixing up a couple of words because they weren't really closely reading the text to make sure that they were choosing the correct word based on how it was being used in the sentence. So make sure that you're reading it carefully for that reason, but also make sure that you're reading it carefully so that when you go to write an ending to the story, which is worth points on the rubric, by the way, it actually makes sense. Like I had all kinds of people in last week's story about um, the duck head pie. Um, I had lots of people continuing the story by telling me about how Anthony succeeded in not making the last quack duck head pie. Well, in the end of what the, the original story, Anthony had graduated from culinary school. So when you write an ending to the story, that is before what had already happened in the story, that doesn't make any sense. So you need to make sure that you're reading the story so that you can write an ending to the story that makes sense with what's already been written in the story. Okay, so read that story carefully so that you can complete it carefully. I've been saying this, Mrs. Hoffman has been saying this since the beginning of the school year, like literally since August. So guys, nothing has changed. The only difference is that well, it's not even a difference that you're doing this at home because it was always homework. So I'm not grading it any differently just because you're not in the classroom every day. That's the bottom line, okay? The expectations are still the same. So let's make sure that we're meeting them. All right, so then we move on to our Scope Magazine. Um, the assignment for that for today should look pretty similar to what we've been doing the last few weeks or what we did, I guess, not last week, but the two weeks before that. Um, I took the quiz from the Scope magazine and turned it into a Canvas quiz. And really, I mean, it's not a quiz. It's just a worksheet, basically. It goes over um, several different skills that we've worked on throughout the year. So it's kind of a review of some different skills um, that we've been talking about all year long that you've been working on um, since elementary school. So use your magazine, um, the article is on pages 26 and 27. The module for today has a link again to the Scope magazine and then the PDF version of it is in yesterday's uh, module as well. So there are all sorts of ways that you can get a hold of that if your magazine has come up missing. Um, hopefully it hasn't, but just in case there are some backup plans for you. All right, so use that magazine, use that article to help you to answer the six questions. There's no extended response on this week's worksheet, um, and you'll find out the reason for that later on this week, hint, hint. All right, so that's really all I need to go over with you for today, so super short lesson today. So just to recap, story 22 is due by midnight tonight. Take the B version if you always take the B version. 
And then um, we also have the six question worksheet over our aliens article. It's titled Aliens Worksheet in your um, Canvas module. And then finally, we need to work on Reading Plus and getting some reading minutes in today. All right, have a great day. We're already, well, once we're done with today, we're already halfway there, halfway through the week. So make it a good one.